the MC women's soccer team took on Cecil College on Saturday, October the 4th at Soccer Plex. The Raptors were 2-5 and five coming in and in need of a win. Cecil was 3-4-1 and one going into the match. The big problem this year for Montgomery College has been a lack of scoring. They have really struggled to put the ball in the back of the net, but they got off to a very quick start as Jewel Johnson made an attack up the left-hand side, feeds it to Anna Cordon, and Anna buries it in the back of the net for her third goal of the year, and quickly the Raptors were up 1-0. Soon after, Johnson was at it again as she takes another through pass on an attack up the left-hand side, but a great stop there by the Cecil goalkeeper to keep the lead at 1-0 Raptors. But again, Raptors with more pressure. This time ahead to Caitlin Snyder. Snyder's shot, again, another nice stop by the Cecil keeper. But the Raptors just kept it going. Here comes Snyder. And she buries it with a big leg in the back of the net to give the Raptors a 2-0 lead. Again, Caitlin Snyder, one of the co-captains of the team, recently moved from defense to offense. The Raptors kept up the offensive pressure as Cordon finds Claire Ramirez de Arellano, and she lofts it in from well outside the box to give the Raptors a 3-0 lead. That's Claire Ramirez de Arellano. The Raptors defense was also heard from as Cecil has a breakaway, but watch Tracy Velasquez run her down from behind to prevent the goal and keep the Raptors lead at 3-0. After that key defensive play, the Raptors kept up the offensive pressure as Leslie Rivera finds a streaking Jewel Johnson down the left side. She attacks the, the goal picks up her own rebound and buries it in the back of the net to give the Raptors a 4-0 lead. We're still in the first half, and all of a sudden, the Raptors' offensive woes seem to be behind them. But the Raptors' offense was not done yet. Despite the 4-0 lead, they kept up the pressure. There's a pass ahead to Johnson. She just dribbles her way through the Cecil defense and buries it in the back of the net. That's her second goal of the game, her fourth of the season. And the first half ends with the Raptors holding a very comfortable 5-0 lead over Cecil College. In the second half, Cecil came out strong and they had an early attack, but a great save there by Kara Feinbaum to preserve the 5-0 lead. But Cecil wasn't done yet. Moments later, Ivy Mumo battles through the defense, gets the shot off, and finds the left-hand corner there for the first goal of the game for Cecil. That cuts the MC lead to 5-1. So after Cecil cuts into the lead, the Raptors offense goes right back to work. Here's the Raptors' Mary Jones with a strong shot on goal. It ricochets off a Cecil defender and Claire Ramirez de Araleno scoops up the ricochet and scores another long one to make it Raptors 6-1 over Cecil. And that's how things ended. So with their best offensive showing of the season, the Raptors improved to 3-5 on the year. For the Raptor Report, I'm Michael Brown.